Okay, so today's video is going to be an interesting one. My daughter saw on TikTok a blind bag video. And what I'm talking about is this type of videos right here where people create their own blind bags and then open them. So she decided to make one for me. She called it the green blind bag makeup bag. And here it is. And I'm going to unwrap this and we're going to keep our fingers crossed that we are going to get a legendary product in here. So there could be common, uncommon, rare, or legendary as you can see. So this is going to be fun. So let's get started. I'm so excited. She did such an amazing job. So Dela is very creative and she came up with this idea after she seeing it on TikTok and she decided to create one with makeup for me. We're going to do this blind bag makeup bag unboxing with you guys. These are products that I own and we are going to hope that we're going to find a so-called legendary product in here. So here's a close up. And then here are all of the designs she created for common, uncommon, rare and legendary so let's get started and unbox it i'm gonna go in the first one here and each product she worked very hard and this is what she created and right here it says open and this is a common yeah common product oh the rarity is common look at that it's so very very interesting so let's unwrap it rip me open it says oh okay so for my rarity common is my charlotte tilbury and this is the contour wand is the contour in the shade fair medium i love this product i recommend this product it is so easy to use and so easy to blend perfect for beginners and it's perfect if you do go on vacation so easy to travel to travel with and if you haven't seen it yet, it comes with this sponge on the top. You have to twist the product and then squeeze the product out. Make sure you twist it back so that you don't um, leave it open and leak in your purse or wherever you have it. But here is the first product in our blind bag, makeup bag. Okay, so let's unbox another one. I don't know which one. There's a big one coming here. Here is the next one. What is this? So this is what the packaging looks like. I'm so excited. This is so much fun. Price number two. Okay. This rarity and I'm going to open it with you guys here. What is that? It's an uncommon product. Ooh. So you can see the uncommon product right here. It has a blue circle and it says to cut here. So let's grab our scissors and we're going to cut right here on the dotted line. And what do we have in here? An uncommon product. Ooh, look at this. This is the Westman Atelier Contour Stick in the shade Biscuit. This is one of my newer products in my collection. I've always wanted to have this product. It is, again, another bronzer. I'm obsessed with bronzers. You can see how easy to use. Again, very blendable, a very nice warm color. It is just such a beautiful product to have. Very luxe looking. It has a magnetic closure easy to travel with again it's light but it does have a little bit of weight to it it's not cheap feeling it's actually very luxe feeling and now they did come up with a mini one after i purchased the big one and i spent big money on this they came up with mini one which is smaller which is half of this and half of the price which is all you need for a contour stick and it's in the shade biscuit as well so I was a little bit disappointed because I spent a lot of money on this and I would have bought the mini one for sure. Let me add some lip gloss here. It's just too dry. But yeah, here is the second product in my blind bag. And let's dig in here and see which other product. Another big product coming right up. Ooh, and we also got a note. Oh, okay. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. I would really appreciate it. And I hope you enjoy this fun blind bag. 
and here is the next product and this is price number one and the rarity is let's open it up on camera what does that say uncommon another uncommon product in here that's exciting and let's cut the price up here and let's see what we have here oh this is one of my favorite foundations by Garland L'Essentiel and this is in the shade 01W. This foundation is so beautiful, so long wearing. It's supposed to be a 16 hour wear and it does wear on your face beautifully. This foundation is so beautiful. It feels on the face like a BB cream but it provides that enough high coverage to your face without looking cakey without making you look like you're wearing a lot of foundation this is so beautiful i definitely recommend it it is more on the high end price the only thing i don't like you guys know is probably the pump it's a little bit flimsy you can see that it comes out it still works obviously worst case you can actually unscrew this and use the foundation that way but other than that the formula i definitely recommend the formula and it's still very cute packaging and this is glass okay so i think this is probably the last product in here let's see what else we have in here <gasps> so beautiful she did such a great job didn't she let me know what you guys think down below i think this is such a cute idea to create a blind bag with products that you already own and here is the last price and we have price number four rip me open and it says open right here do you guys see that what is that and here we've got the legendary product we were hoping for so let's see what we have here for a legendary product rip me open oh we got a dior blush this is the dior backstage rosy glow blush in the shade coral this is stunning 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 best blush i own i love it love it love it love it so so much it is so beautiful and so glowy on the face it's just it barely picks up with the finger but with a brush and on the cheeks, it looks so beautiful. Look at this nice glow. It's not as intense as it appears. So don't be afraid of the color. The color looks stunning on the face. Such a legendary product for sure. I definitely agree this is legendary. So I think this was, yeah, this was the last product in our blind bag, makeup bag. And the theme was green because green is my favorite color. As you can see, I'm wearing green today. And I think that this was a fun unboxing and idea without having to spend money on a mystery box. You create your own. And in this case, my daughter Dela did this and I am so proud of her i really enjoyed it it was a fun video let me know down below what you guys think but stay tuned if you want to know what i'm wearing on my eyes i'm excited to tell you i am wearing the natasha denona glam face palette which is the light one so i'm using those brown shades kind of wherever you see brown for transition for smokiness and i'm using this shade in the inner corner and of course the beautiful dual chrome shade that i'm wearing in my middle of the eyelid is this one right here from the Danessa Myricks volume 4 palette this is in the shade awakening I think it's beautiful I love how it just changes from green to purple there's the purple and there's the green I think it's just beautiful so that's what I'm wearing I am also wearing the Patrick Todd bronzer right here and this is in the shade she sculpted patrica blush she's so la and on the lips because i get a lot of questions for my lips i am wearing the makeup forever artist color pencil and this is in the shade anywhere caffeine along with a drugstore lip product this is the maybelline superstay ink crayon and this is let me see if i can find a shade here live on the edge and it's this one right here 
And for my lip gloss, I had to add a little bit of lip gloss because my lips were dry. I'm using the Merit Lip Oil in the shade Taupe. I love this lip oil, it's the tinted lip oil, beautiful. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this very creative unboxing that my daughter came up with after seeing some TikTok videos. And if you did, don't forget to subscribe, like this video, like the note said right here. And I wish you all a wonderful day and I cannot wait to see you in my next one. Love you guys. Bye.